This is a Nook tablet that I recently purchased off of eBay through Barnes & Noble's store. It's a refurbished model. Pre-owned, so this comes with a one-year warranty. Again, I only got this for $80. So, this is a short review about this tablet. Opening it up, there was no screen, screen protector on it. Press the side to turn it on. And that'll load up the Nook software. It takes roughly a minute for it to boot up, so kind of made this video because I thought I was getting a great deal. $80 for a tablet. But then when I started using the Nook software, I realized it's very limited. So it's about to boot up. Well, first thing I did was I went to the the Barnes and Noble store and tried looking for some apps, some common apps that I was used to just installing for free, like Angry Birds or Where's My Water or Draw Something. One thing I noticed is, so I changed the launcher for this. Obviously, I had to root it, but for those who are buying this and expecting just to jump into using the tablet, it won't be the best experience in the world because let's go to shop. If I want to look for something as easy as Angry Birds, Angry Birds, everything costs money. So when I saw this, I thought, wow, must be a way to install third-party apps or just install it through my SD card these some of these apps I can get for free but nope you can't sideload apps off of the Nook tablet you have to root it and then enable some hidden settings so I can use uh, third-party apps so going back to the home I was able to root this. Trying to find the rooting steps were very confusing. They're actually a very easy way to install root using an SD card. Someone's made it. I'll provide a link to that way of rooting your Nook tablet. This is the 8 gigabyte model. And also, I'll try to provide some instructions on how to make the tablet more usable i.e. installing a new launcher which I did using the Go launcher if I press home over here now I have access to stuff such as the Play Store which I installed after getting root this was done through the, the SD card root so now I can search for free apps like Angry. Oops. Angry Birds. So, in comparing this tablet versus, let's say, the competitors like a Nexus or um, even a Kindle Fire, I would have to say if you want something that you can use very easily, I might have to recommend a different tablet. So, 